I'm, Hi. I'm well, thank you. Hi, this is so nice to speak to you. I am personally such a big fan of the show and your character. So it's a very, it's a great thank moment. You. <laughs> so I just, I like to begin <laughs> by asking that um, obviously we've seen Miranda Bailey's character grow and evolve. So with her character, how have you and your relationship with it evolved as well? Can you tell us a bit about that? So when uh, Grey's Anatomy started, um, uh, Dr. Bailey was a resident who always saw herself as chief. Uh, so I think one of the exciting things about playing the character and watching the character as an audience member is to see someone who had a goal and over the years we've been able to watch her obtain that goal and not fit in that goal. Uh, you know, she because this is the way she always thought of herself. Uh, me as an actor, it's been really exciting to keep alive a character for myself um, that, you know, it's some, for some actors it may be hard to play the same character season after season. I find it challenging. I find it incredibly rewarding. And it's basically because our writers keep coming up with amazing things uh, for Bailey to do. And I keep learning things about Bailey every episode. Uh, so it continues to be exciting for me. That's, that's amazing. And um, earlier this year, you directed an episode of Grey's Anatomy, one of the milestone episodes. So uh, what was that experience like? Um, I, I was incredibly flattered and incredibly excited to be able to have been given that opportunity. Um, I truly, you know, understood what that meant to pass um, ER, the longest running network medical drama. Um, uh, and it was just an exciting feeling for for all of us uh, in the entire production to be able to reach that milestone. Uh, so I, I was really excited and really flattered to have been given that opportunity. Um, well, the the interesting position that we've been in is that because we have been working um, all of this time, um, you know, we the, there's a different way, you know, that we see what the opportunities have been um, out there. Um, <clears throat> so we've, we've been really fortunate to, um, you know, not necessarily have been a part of the competition, I think, yeah, you know, as an actor in order to, to get roles. Um, my my motivating factor for being with Grace, though, is not is less about not being able to work, but more about wanting to see Bailey's journey and be able to take it from the beginning all the way to whatever its end is going to be. That's really exciting to me. Um, uh, and I'd love to be able to look back on this time at Grace and be able to say that I started it and I finished it. Like that, that would be an amazing uh, accomplishment for me as an actor. Okay, one last question is that uh, obviously the first the first episode when I saw you, I it just felt like you like the role was written for you. But apart from Miranda Bailey, if you had to pick another character on the show that you found interesting, that you thought you wanted to play or could play, which one would that be? Oh, my goodness. I'm not, I'm not sure. But you know what? Maybe I would be a nurse. <laughs> because yeah. sometimes uh, a, a lot of people that watch the show automatically assume that I'm a nurse until they, they realize that I'm chief of surgery. So <laughs> maybe I would be like one of our nurses instead. <laughs> but that is not something I was expecting. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, okay. All right. Thank you so much. This was amazing.